Okay, so for the last few months I've been doing a lot of burpees, but I haven't really been doing anything else too much. So I come up with something that hopefully will help me diversify a little bit. And as far as I'm going to call it my gateway exercises. I picked three of them that as far as I am, I'm going to try to do every day. And I don't have to do a lot, but I just have to do at least one stuff. So, um, so um, I'm going to show them. And by broadcasting, you know, things like this, as far as it seems to uh, make me a little bit more disciplined. So um, this kind of defines what they are. It kind of, I'm, I'm putting it out that this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to like account for it when I do burpees that, yeah, I did my gateway exercises or I didn't do my gateway exercises. So anyway, um, I'm going to give this a try and see if this helps. The reason why I call it gateways because as far as hopefully like drugs, as far as it'll, it'll lead to to, uh, to other drugs or, or, or other exercises and stuff. So anyway, the first one is what I call a Hindu, or what's called a Hindu push-up. I like this. You get in this position, kind of a downward dog position, so you get yourself a nice stretch. It feels good. I like this position anyway. And then, and then as far as you just go down, and like I say, all I gotta do to count is just do one. And so I just kind of just hold it like this. Just let it stretch out and then return. And if I want to do a bunch or if I want to do one now and then some in the afternoon or at night, that's okay. So, but as far as that counts, I did Hindu push-ups. So I did my first gateway exercises. The next one that I like, and I like this position really well too. I just, I just like the stretch, you know, just a kind of a deep squat position. Um, I just, I don't know, it just feels good. So, so, uh, but as far as my next one is, is a frog stand. And uh, it's just a good position. You just get yourself up there and hold. And I can hold as much as I want. Just a few seconds. Like this counts. And uh, did my frog stand so, you know, for the day. Or I can do it 10 minutes if I feel like it throughout the day. And the last one is kind of a more kind of an athletic one as far as it involves hand balancing which of course as far as I enjoy and this one's a little bit um, it kind of challenged me a little bit I call a jump squat handstand and it looks like this let's get you to move Daisy come on Daisy over here out of the way you're gonna get kicked okay all right so it looks like this I'm in this nice deep squat position just like this which I like and what I'm going to do as far as I'm going, I, so I, that's why I call it jump squat position. I'm going to jump with the idea is hopefully my feet will come off the ground before my hands go down. Go on, get back. Okay, right, going to get kicked. Okay, so got my hands up here, so I'll give it a try. Like I said, I'm not real good at it, so, but as far as something I like to work on, so looks like this. And I got it pretty good. So then I can just sit here my legs stretched out like this or I can close it up into handstand and then come down and I can't quite do it yet but maybe I can get myself in a frog stand position but I'm not quite able to do it yet but and then return to the deep squat position so I can do another one if I want or uh, just that for the day so as of today What's the day today? It's May 10th, 2012. I did my gateway exercises, so I can check it off. So that's good. Okay.